Yeah, another room right here, so let's see what's in here. <laughs> Someone has come. Someone is here in the dark. Oh my god, it's Bray Wyatt dressed in a costume. Okay, no, it's not Bray Wyatt. It's a ghost in a... Some ghost with a lantern. <laughs> oh, could it be? <laughs> it's Mario. Looks like you're mine, Mario. <laughs> I won't let you go anywhere. Follow the buzzards! So yeah, this guy... I'll take care of you quickly, then, ret then return to my darkness. I hate the light. So I'll take you with me to the deep dark. So yeah, so this guy right here, the lantern ghost... Um... It actually, say, actually, the reason why I say he's Bray Wyatt and the ghost because he carries a lantern like Bray Wyatt does, so... But he's a lantern ghost, and we're in the dark, so we can't t uh, can't attack him, so... Until we actually do, do something to the lantern. Yeah, if you attack the lantern, it'll actually get brighter and brighter, so we can actually attack the guy. So this is the big lantern ghost. Um, he tries this big lantern ghost. Okay, he has 40 HP and 5 attack power. Now, who actually has attack? He has, he has one attack called a flash attack. It'll actually damage your party members as, excuse me, as well. And yes, um, hit the lantern as many times as you can so it will become brighter. And when you get to bright enough, you can actually attack him. Ah, oh, that light is so bright. This is no good. Here, darker and darker. Yes, yeah, so you actually blow it out, and you have to, uh, you have to, uh, attack it some more, and unfortunately I failed. And I'm actually gonna switch to, uh, Bombette here. Make the lantern go up. And that right there, that's what I was talking about. It actually caused your party member to be out for two turns. See, that kinda sucked. But we have a good old power bounce that I actually do the trick. Some nice damage, almost 10 damage. Unfortunately, Bombad is still out, so I can actually, so I can't do damage. Unfortunately. And thanks to the uh, Zap Tap badge, it actually takes some damage as well. There's some damage to the power bounce, and let's actually... Can we... Unfortunately, you can only attack this guy with Bombette with the power bomb, unfortunately. No bomb, you can't attack him. <laughs> Kinda sucks, though, so... So I may actually switch to, uh, Goombario. Here, let's see. Yeah, we'll switch to Goombario. Alrighty, do two damage, that's nice. Oh wow, blocked it, that's nice. If you can block it, your partners won't become vulnerable. He's about gone though, so that's good. So a couple more turns, yeah, he's down to 6 HP. Put you the bot, I was gonna blow that out. Okay, Goombar was gonna do that. And let's actually, oh, let's see. Eh, yeah, I didn't quite finish him off this turn, but we'll... This turn, this time around. That's a normal jump. And down, and he's down. And oh my god, Merly, thank you, thank you. Save the day right there, and with that, we actually get a level up. So yeah, I approve of that. And this time we're going to upgrade FP. No. Bye bye. And what's with the lantern? Bust it open. Oh, hello there. <laughs> Yay! I got out. Yay for me. Thanks, Mister. Hey, aren't you a uh, Mario? Yeah, you dang right. You saved me like a hero. You're a hero, aren't you? You're the coolest. You saved me from the mean guy who laughed like, Wee hee hee! I gotta make it up to you. I'll go with you, Mario, okay? I heard the uh, shy guy saying that you're trying to save Princess Peach from Bowser. You're super great. You're the greatest great guy. 
I think you're the best. So, um, I really want to help. I'll be good, really. So, yes, after we defeat the Lantern Ghost, we get a new party member. What? If you press the down C button, you can have her, uh, light up the area that's in, light up an area that's, uh, completely filled with darkness. So, she's gonna be kind of useful. And in battle, she, she can shock enemies with Electro Dash or paralyze them with Power Shock. Oh, it's pretty dark, huh? I kind of like the dark, but uh, now I can show you how helpful I can be, okay? Use my power, okay? So press the down C button with what? Wow, pretty cool, huh? Look, look, it's so bright now. Oh, excuse me. I bet nobody else can help you out like that, can they? Nope, now, let's go. Okay, so yeah, so it'll actually light up the area in here. And I don't know there's any other star pieces here, so... So yeah, with Y here, if only that, you can actually light up blocks that you can't see. Like here we get a snowman stone, which is pretty useful. And there's actually a very important block uh, right here. See that red block? So you got, that's actually invisible and actually builds another deep focus badge. I can actually get up there, thank you. Thank you very much. And actually going over here to this power block that you actually need pair carry for. And, and right off the bat, we'll actually, we'll actually upgrade our Watt. So that's nice. That is nice indeed. So yeah. So yes, yeah, so what? So she'll have a new ability and do some more damage right, right away. Then you had her for one minute and she's already upgraded. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut here for just a minute, guys. I'm actually gonna see something, so... I'll be right back. Alright, guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. Um, I actually, uh... actually went to check something, and, uh, now I'm back. That one has some coins in it. This block right here. Alright, whenever we get the chance here, I'll show you what Watt can do in battle, so... So, yeah. But, freaking Merly coming in and giving us some more star points, which is enough for us to get a level up, so yeah, I approve of that. Alright, so let's go through here and... Okay, that shot guy's running. Why is he running? Normally, he'll try to come out and fight us, but... He, he jumped over this uh, block of toys, which uh, you can have Bombat destroy. Kaboom! And oh, holy crap! What are these bunch of shot guys here? Oh, there's a shooting star. That's a good item. Don't, <laughs> don't I missed? Or don't he missed? Actually, <laughs> they're all running. So, okay, so right here, I want to get the shooting star because this is actually a pretty damn good item. And I need Cooper to get it. Unfortunately, you can't get it. Have to be a little bit closer. We'll try that. Huh. There's something I'm missing here? Let me get Watt back out. Oh, there is a block there. Okay, so now we can actually uh, have Cooper. Now we can actually get that... Get that shooting star. I thought that was even there. Alright, so here we have the shooting star. Our start hits all enemies and does six damage, so that's a really good item. Sleepy sheep, nah, I don't really care about that, but I'm actually gonna go ahead and show what Watt can do in battle here. And we have a bunch of enemies here. Okay, so we have uh Electro Dash. Penetrates defense power and attract Attack an enemy with electricity, so that's pretty good. So first of all, I'm going to attack this mana guy. Four damage. And yeah, uh, let's do a Quake Hammer. Ah, uh, you know what? I should have actually finished up the mana guy right there while I'm at it. Ah, I can always go back in the... Ha ha ha! 
Yeah, that's what the man guy does. They actually heal up one of his partners. So, okay, so here is Watt's uh, other move. This is a uh, power shock. It will paralyze an enemy with an electro shock. So, so yeah. You gotta press A repeatedly. If you get it closer to the top or full 100%, you actually paralyze that enemy for a little while. Four turns for the groove guys. So, so yeah. That's what that does, and we're actually going to give this guy a power bounce. Finish him off, so you want to heal anybody else? Ah, that groove guy can be dangerous, so be careful with him. And finally, for what we have Turbo Charge. It actually boosts Mario's attack power for a short time. So yeah, press the A button as soon as it lights up. Now, if you do it all three times, um, your attack power will go up for four turns, so... So, yeah, I'll show that. It's pretty good for especially boss battles. But, you gotta time it just right. As soon as the uh, as it lights up, you hit the A button. You hit the A button, is what I meant to say. And you actually get if you hit it just right all three times, you actually you actually you actually be powered up for four turns. So yeah, why is actually a pretty good party member. I'll give him that. So give her that. All right, so there we go. We finished up those guys off. So um, okay, I'm actually gonna go back hit that heart block before I actually uh, before I actually move on here. So. So I actually heal up my HP and FP, so... Can't go in there with uh, low AFP, FP and HP. If you know what I mean. Alright, so now let's see where the Shy Guys went. I'm not gonna, get, I'm not gonna get a sleep, sleepy sheet, they're kinda useless. Room is dark, so of course I have Watt. Light it up. And we're going to reveal these uh, shy guys. I don't know what the hell they're doing. Run! Run for it! Wow! Help me! And they're actually bust the wall down. Wow. That was pretty impressive. So now we can actually go in this room right here. So, you came, did you? I'm General Guy. We're following order, but the orders of King Bowser by guarding a star spirit. As long as we keep it secure, we have permission to do whatever we want. You hear it? You hear? I don't care for you, sir. You are rude, and furthermore, you are, you're trespassing in here. Our toy box is off limits to the likes of you. The treasures inside this box are for shy guys only. And that star spirit's fate is none of your business. Prepare to fight me, sir. Taste the feet! Charge! Okay, so we have the boss battle. This is uh, General Guy. But before we actually find him, like, he's actually going to send his army to attack us. Okay, guys, all together now. Let's rush him. Charge! Okay, so we have a bunch of shy guys here. If we actually uh, attack them, Mario can actually get rid of four of them. Okay. Why? I'm actually going to use Waffle for a little while here. Oh wow, block him off, that's, and again, the zap tap badge comes into play. But I do like that. Oh my god, thank you Merly once again. We're actually going to finish off the uh, Shy Guy army right here, but it's not done yet. Mercy, he beat them all up. This sure, that surely isn't good. Guess it's up to me. And, after seeing that, General Guy is going to come in and his uh, little toy tank and actually gonna do some business. Mario, you sir will pay. You beat my infantry. But that's all you'll do. Prepare for the next wave. Okay, next wave. He's actually gonna send stilt guys now. So yeah. Go! Attack stilt guys! Fight! 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 Okay, so we have stilt guys. They have 7 HP and I believe... Three attack power? Or four attack power? I don't know, so... But they have the same HP as a shy guy. But, if you actually knock them down, do a couple hits, they'll actually become normal shy guys, so... So, yeah. They do have seven HP. Haha, <laughs> idiot. 
They do four damage, okay. So they have the same amount of damage as a uh, power up guy, but if you actually hit them a couple of times, they actually become normal uh, shy guys. Alright, last one coming up. There we go. <laughs> Unbelievable. I guess it's time for my special battalion. Okay, so General Guy is going to have one more spe uh, battalion here. We have these shy guys here. They're actually going <laughs> to... One came in from the tank. <laughs> I pity you, sir. It's time you paid, Mario. Attack! Yes, sir! Okay, so let's actually do a Quake Hammer to these buttholes. So we have, um... So we have, uh, I'm actually going to switch to Goombario here. We're actually going to tile him this time. This is the Shy Stack. They're actually base, base of, uh, they're basically, basically a bunch of Shy Guys. All together, these Shy Guys have 10 HP and 1 attack power, so... So basically... The attack power equals the number of guys in a stack. It'll be four if there are four stacks. So yeah. So yeah, basically four shot guys do four damage, three, three, and so on and so on. So yeah. Like that right there. Oh wow. Okay, uh... Let's do a power smash. That should do some damage. Oh yeah, six damage. And we're gonna bring Watt back out. I'll bring Goombario back out for the final wave, so. There we go. Blocked him, so that's nice. Okay, Power Smash. Six damage, and. W and then Watt's gonna finish him off. And there we go, that's the uh, Shy Stacks. Dot, 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 dot. Ah, fine, I'll beat you myself. Nobody embarrasses the brave shy guys of my army. Nobody. Okay, so now we are finally going to fight General Guy. He's actually going to be in this tank, though, so... We're actually going to first start out with the Snowman's doll. It's actually uh, targeting a light bulb here. And if you get rid of that light bulb, um, they're actually... Uh, uh, Gets rid of one of the attacks of the tank. Grrr, that hurts. Where'd you learn to fight? You must have. You must be cheating. Call me a freaking cheater, will ya? Dumbass. Okay, so let's uh, tackle General Guy. Seems to be dangerous. Yeah, the tank is dangerous, even though it's a toy. Okay, General Guy, or the tank, whatever, he had, Okay, General Guy has 30 HP, 4 attack power, 2 defense, probably because of the tank. Uh, so, if General Guy has some attacks as well, we'll actually throw bombs at you. And I'm going to actually use electric attacks, um, which will, which is the reason why there's a light bulb there. So, we'll actually do 5 damage, and I'll we'll actually put your party member out for 2 turns. So, But if we actually damage the light bulb here, we'll actually, we'll actually lose electric attacks, so... So yeah. And right there is what he's talking about. So yes, Goombardo's gonna be down for a couple of turns. But thankfully I have a Thunder Rage that'll actually take him out. And I also have Star Storm. I think the light bulb has seven or ten HP, I believe. This is other attack, it's very easily dodged, and oh crap. Better heal up, because I'm about ready to die. And I think I blocked too early, though. Let's see. So yeah, once you take out that lob bulb attack, the rest of the general guys should be a snap. Uh, we do have a star storm here. I'm actually going to I'm actually going to switch to bomb bat here because the bomb can actually do her bomb attack will actually do some damage. That's what I'm going to do now. Oh man, I'm about to switch to parry carry though. More damage. I don't know if the power bomb will actually do more damage. I'll find out right here shortly. And I have a snowman doll. Do four extra damage. Well, 
Well, I don't think it's gonna matter now. Yep, bomb back and finish him off in one bomb. And <laughs> now goes General Guy. Get 33 extra star points. And the shot guys the general guys are, general guy is gonna be running rampant. Oh! <laughs> okay, I fell. That must be that same clumsy shot guy that fell earlier. But look at this! We have rescued our the fourth star spirit. Let's wait for it to come down here. And there we go, ladies and gentlemen, our fourth star spare has been rescued, and I believe with that, we're halfway done. End of chapter. To save the fourth star spare, spare muscular, Mario and team disband the sh gang of shy guys to span shy guys. Slowly, it seems as if the light forces return to the once bleak night sky. But the stars won't truly shine until the star rod is wrestled from Bowser's evil grasp. Three star spirits still await rescued. Still await rescued. Where in the world are they being held? That's a good question. Well, we'll probably find out here shortly after this uh, peach segment. Hey, Twink, those guards have stopped paying attention to us again. Let's sneak out of here. We might be able to find some news to help Mario. Do you think it's still safe to use that secret path? Don't you think Bowser's figured it out by now? It's still alright, Twink. Bowser hasn't noticed anything. He looks scary, but he's basically a major bonehead. Let's get out of here. Come on. Alright, so we're going to do some more stuff out here. I'm actually going to put the uh, Power Rush badge, or Last Stand badge, whatever it's called, in the uh, treasure test, so Mario can actually go and get it. So yeah, we're going to do some exploring. Let's see here. Um, okay, first of all, I'm actually going to go into to uh, in here. I guess I'll. Uh, huh? Who are you? Oh my God! It's Romaine guy again. Why, well, I'm Princess Peach, and who might you be? Oh, you're Princess Peach. Everyone calls me the Gourmet Guy for some reason. I guess I better report you to King Bowser. You aren't supposed to leave your room. But I'm really hungry. Tell you what, I'll keep this a secret if you make me something really yummy. So Princess Peach, what do you say? Will you cook me something or what? I'd love to cook for you, Mr. Gourmet Guy, but I have no ingredients and no utensils. Ah, that's no problem. There's a kitchen one floor below us. It's five star. You can go, you can go cook there. Here, you need this. This key will open the door that leads downstairs. Now you can get into the kitchen. Okay, so with that, we can actually go to one floor down in the uh, castle, so that's nice. So I'll sit here and wait for my yummy meal, okay? Oh yeah, I forgot. There are plenty of guard guards downstairs, so be careful. Alright, so now we actually, Gourmet Guy wants something else to eat, even though he had that cake. Okay, I'm going to go in here for a minute. I'm actually going to uh, put in the Power Rust badge, so Mario can actually get that. And, oh god, we about got caught right there. Okay, we're basically done in here. We can actually go downstairs now. We actually need to go into the kitchen, but before we do, I'm actually going to go into the other rooms. And be careful down here, because there are actually still some guards here. Oh god, I got caught. Well, oh, dang it. So yes, if you get caught once, you'll actually return back to your room. Oh, dang it. <laughs> Let's throw it down. Alright, so let's try this again. Let's actually not get stupid get caught this time. That would be wonderful. Okay, so now we're down a lower level now. Let's this guy go. 
It's almost like that mini game, that one barrel mini game from Donkey Kong 64. Uh, Stealthy Snoop, I think is what it's called. But this one's not that as bad as uh, Stealthy Snoop. And here's a room that's unfinished, so we'll come back here later. But not right now. Not right now, I say. Okay, don't turn. To okay, thank God. I'm thinking there's where we need to go. Okay, well, I'm gonna go in here. Hello, is anyone in here? Somebody in here. And here's another treasure chest. I can actually open it. We get the last stand badge. When Mario's in danger, he only receives half the damage, so. Basically, Mario, he'll, uh. He'll get half the damage he receives if he's uh, in danger, so. What's in here? Oh, it's a toad! Oh no, I'm caught for sure! Huh? Princess Peach, you're okay! Thank the stars! You're a toad from the castle! How long have you been hiding in here? Well, since Bowser took over, I was so scared of being caught that I jumped into this closet. I'm hiding here until Mario comes and saves us all. Princess Peach, you ought to hide too. It's risky out there. Please don't take any chances. Well, we have to to figure out what where Mario's where the next star spirits are, so... Peach doesn't have much of a choice, so... I guess... I can, I can go back and put that uh, badge in there. You know what? That's what I'm gonna do. I'll get caught. I actually, I actually meant to do that, so... I actually did that so I can actually go back to uh, to the first floor rooms. Well, the treasure, remember the treasure chest is what I wanted to do. So I can actually put that badge in. Alright, let's try this again. Okay, I'm just gonna go to the room now. This will actually be a long peach segment, so... And after that, we'll actually get to, uh, get to cooking. Okay, now this is the... <laughs> this is gourmet guys. This is what gourmet guy is. Whoops. Okay, oh crap. Okay, good. Okay... Yeah, that's where we were. This one will actually take us to the library. Yep, this is where we find out where Tubbut, where the next star spirit was. In the, basically, well, actually not where the next star spirit was. Actually, where uh, about Tubbut blah, blah. Okay. No, keep quit going in there, Peach. Here's the room. <laughs> Jeez, I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, so now it's. In the last stand. Okay, so now that we got that stuff out of the way, let's actually um, go downstairs and start uh, cooking that uh, cake that Gourmet Guy wants. But he didn't actually say he wanted a cake, but now uh, you know what I mean. Okay, gotta be very careful right here, because uh, the kitchen is a. Uh... Shoot. Go, 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 go. Okay, here's the kitchen over here. All right, here we are. Well, here's the kitchen. So, what shall we do first? Well, start cooking, duh. Princess Peach, this looks like a good cookbook. Let's use it, okay? How's it look, Twink? Anything really look really yummy? Hang on a second. Oh, how about this? Special strawberry cake. Sounds good. Let's whip one up. Okay, Twink, leave me the recipe. Well, okay, please listen carefully. First, put sugar and eggs in the bowl. Okay, so so we're going to actually make a cake. Make a cake here. Uh, so first off, we need sugar and eggs. Let's actually add some cleanser to it. Okay, no. We're not going to be that kind of a dick. Okay, sugar... Okay, and then eggs. And then once you get done, you just go to Twink and say yes, or you can start over if you want to. Okay, so next, mix and whip the ingredients in the bowl. Okay, so right here we're going to mix the ingredients. Right here, we got to press A as fast as we can for 10 seconds to mix it, so. Alright, here we go. Oh, 
Okay, there we go. So that's it. Alright, so, so next up... Okay, flour and butter is next. Okay. Okay, let's see. There's the flour. Okay, we're looking for... Okay, there's the butter. You know, I wonder how those guards don't hear us in here. That's what I'm wondering. Oh, well, I guess the... I don't know. Okay, after you mix the ingredients, pour the ingredients in the bowl, pour it into the pan. Alright, so that's all we got. Alright. Alright, now, bake the batter in the oven for 30 seconds. Okay, so now we're actually done. This is the most crucial part right here. Now you can't redo this one. We gotta bake, bake the cake for 30 seconds, so... Okay. Okay, um... I'm looking at my clock right here. I'm actually gonna wait until, uh... Let's see... Ah, oh, shoot. I screwed that up, so... Hang on for just one moment, and... There we go. So, keep put it in there for 30 seconds, and then when 30 seconds have passed, press the A button to take it out, so... Alright, there we go. And a perfectly baked cake. Alright, so all we gotta do now is actually uh, decorate it. Okay, this is the last thing to do. We're gonna decorate it with cream and strawberries. Let me know when you're all... Okay, yeah. So now we're gonna decorate with cream and strawberries. And a little bit of cleanser. Okay, no. I don't want to redo this again, so... I'm gonna poison them with cleanser. <laughs> Okay, so now we're going to decorate strawberries, and there we go, she's done. Yes, we made it, it looks great. Okay, let's take it to, let's take it to Gourmet Guy. Okay, so here's what I'm wondering. How are the guards not knowing that, or smelling the cake? They would have obviously smelled something and would have done something. But, I don't know. Alright, here we go. Oh, I've been waiting so long. I've wasted away to nothing. Okay, is he actually going to go crazy again like he did um, when we gave him that cake? Okay. Oh. 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 Delicious. This is way too delicious. Yeah, he's going to go crazy once again. <laughs> But he's actually not going to fly in the air like he did last time. Whew, that was really good. I haven't felt this way since, well, ever. To show you my gratitude, I'll tell you a secret. Ooh, what kind of secret? One of the star spirits is inside Mount Lava Lava on Lava Lava Island. This island's to the south. You should tell this to Mario, but you better tell him that there's also a nasty lava piranha guarding the star spirit. He better be careful. I really don't dislike Mario. That's why I'm telling you this. So he's actually returning the favor for us, since we have, since Mario and now Peach helped him, he's actually told us where the next star spirit is. Twink, did you hear that? Mount Lava Lava? Lava Lava Island. The star spirit is being held inside that volcano. Mario can really use this information, huh? Yes, he could. Twink, I'm sorry, I'm sorry that I keep asking you to do stuff, but can you go tell Mario? Of course I will. I'll do it right now. Uh, I'll be back soon, Princess Peach. What's with all the shouting? Keep quiet in here. Oh, God. And Kimmy Koopa's, uh... Oh, well, Peach didn't even run for it. So, it was you, Princess Peach. You've got to keep it down. You're a prisoner, and as a prisoner, you need to keep... What? What are you doing out of your room anyway? Go! 
cards! Get the princess! No! Yes! You, you, <laughs> you say no, I say yes!